Welcome back to another edition of Dante's PvP Souls. That's right, I am back. And this time I'm using the one, the only, the slightly red rusted, or is that blood rusted? I don't know. The amazing winged knight, Albert. Of course, this is a winged knight, Albert. I made it heavy as was a suggestion, a suggestion in the chat on twitch.tv forward slash Dante WTFUM, which I am live recording right now as we speak. Um, and I'm ready to smash some skulls. So, 575 AR, pretty good. And I tried at first to do it sharp because it was able to get two different, but I guess different variations of attribute bonuses mean different things. So, if there's an A scaling in... Dexterity, it could be different than an A scaling in strength, which is a little confusing. Anyways, Exile Mask, Cathedral Knight, Wolf, and Black Iron Leggings. I do have 40 poise, which is pretty decent. Devil's Ring, Prisoner's Chain, Chloranthi Ring, and Ring of Favor. Now, here are my stats. 35, 10, 35, 17, and then 66 strength, and of course, 16 dexterity, so I can use this weapon but it stops at 66 strength because, and I've been told, when you two-hand it, you add, uh, or it's one time, 1.3 times itself. So 66 times basically uh, 33, well, plus 33, which is a, th a third of 100, I guess. It may boost it up to 99, and basically that's why the cap is there. However, if I was one-handing it, it would be different. I'd have to go up to 99, I believe, to reach the... 575 attack power or something to that effect which is a dumb in my opinion but whatever this game's out it's already there it's already over either way i'm looking to do a lot of damage i don't know how well i'm gonna do against shields and i want to try the weapon art but i don't know if you don't already know i don't buff my character i don't buff my weapon do about 10 fights in a pontiff solivan area let's see how i do round one against me and go hopefully they'll find that asshole over there I, I hate when people, like, people do that crap. I was about to say, why did I hit that guy? Woo! That range, though. Whoa! Get him out of here. Wow. That was befuddling, to say the least. Woo. Round two against Ka Kasi. 0707. I got lucky that stunned him there, to be honest. That didn't make any sense when I was clearly looking at him. Alright, what's going on here with the internet? Just freaking demented. Nice jumping attack, but... I don't... Alright, we are not getting good connections here. Holy... Crap. That guy got a backstab like two seconds after I turned around and looked at him. Like, I know the game, okay? That crap doesn't happen. Anyways, round three against a great hammer. See, now this is a... I have to play a little bit slow. I do want to do the weapon art on this guy. Wow, that hit me pretty far away. Oh, nice. That's the roll punish. He could have just swung, and he maybe could have caught me there, but I preyed on his insecurity. Round four against Zach Lyon. Zach Lyon. Want to do the weapon arm. Damn it, man. Woo. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> I wanted it. What is he? Why is he only doing running? Okay. They, I feel like they wanted to lose. Sometimes when I see a player play like that, it's like, what are you doing? All right. <laughs> Round five against the Somber, Somber Lane. All right, weapon arm. Oh, look at that weapon R725. Ah, oh, I'm never gonna get anybody with that. Wow, flawless victory. I'll take it. They just didn't have spacing. Their sword was too slow. I really don't even understand what the hell they were going for. I'll be honest with you. All right, round six against Kimu, 1985-77. Alright, key move. Alright, okay, okay. Get him out of here. Look at that latency, though, on that last hit. I swiped his neck out of his body, and yet still sometimes, or still it took that long to kill him. All right, anyways, round seven against, oh, what the hell is this? I don't know why that blocked me. Oh crap. That sucks. That was stupid. Get him out of here. Trying to be aggressive with that crap. All you do is block and you get out of that. That parry, like, I, I just didn't have stamina, I guess? I don't know. That was weird. That did actually a surprising amount. Damn it. I'm trying it, but it's not working. Wow, he just took that. The hyper armor. Well, let me get the weapon art. Suck at that. I can't believe I actually. Oh. Whoa. Oh, damn it. Son of a bitch. That was. That doesn't happen often. Usually what happens is they blip out. I rarely blip out. That was weird. Round. Eight against King Cloud. Come on, buddy. All right. There we go. Get him out of here. It just... I knew I was going to break that shield. Just something told me. Round nine against Twist Devil Nine. Uh, this now I know those weapons have like insane hyper armor. What are you doing, bro? Get him out of here for a thousand ninety-three damage. Wow, that's how hyper armor works. He just went in to the spin to win. What is he doing? Terrible. Round something.
Oh, here we go. One handing it. Oh, you lucky suck. Mm. To the city. Get him out of here. I don't know why. Like, the fact that he was able to do that even once without getting punished for it is absurd. I do like what's happening with this guy over here, though. I'm a big fan. <clears throat> All right, round so nine against fishies. All right, sword and board. What? How'd that not hit him? He gets two hits on me? Where's your internet? Get him out of here. Woo! Damn it, I wanted him dead. Get him out of here! Would you try to backstab me, you son of a pig? That's what you get. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I don't know this. Maybe you can tell me this. Can you backstab while your shield is up? If you can do that, that's actually incredible. Can you do that? I don't know. Round 11 against Spiora. Eh? Teh. One. Let's hope his connection isn't bad. What is he holding? That hit the wall or something? It hit me! <laughs> I don't understand, okay? He tried using the disc, which was so bad. So bad. Round 12. I shouldn't even count that. That was three hits? Okay. Romanamanima. Holy crap. What is that shooting at? Why is that not shooting at me? How'd that hit me? How did that hit me after he was dead? Come on. Oh, God. 20 bigger meta, yes. Round 13. Yeah, that was awesome. I like when I don't get the backstab. Yeah. I feel bad. It just... You just barely wait, and you can just kill. It's annoying. Round 14 against Brady. Okay. Double zero K. He's got thousands of nothing. Where you going, buddy? Oh! Son of a bitch, you got so lucky I couldn't get my hyper armor. Back up, Savage. Whoa. Alright. Whatever. That was, like, I was feeling so many rumbles. Next up, we have Half Quail. Ooh. I'm surprised that didn't hit me, to be honest.
Get him out of here! That range, though, this does have uh, pretty good range. I gotta be honest. I think it has. Does it have more range than other halberds? I don't know. Oh, Ro Romin uh, is back. Ah, F this. Ah! You just gotta be aggressive. They just didn't know how to handle it, I think. I don't know. Too much trading was happening. They're t only taking three. Oh, God. Round 87 against Blue Oni. Come on. To the city. I got lucky there. I got lucky. I also got lucky there. But, uh... Yep. Flawless victory. Round something against Bacon Chew Toy. This might be a hard matchup for me. Crap. Damn, his connection is good. Come on. Ah. <laughs> I can't even see right now. Get him out of here. That was... <laughs> he, he used the doors poorly, but that was hard. Uh-oh, Hulkman is here, ladies and gentlemen. This could be a tough matchup. Hulkman, 39-year-old with slorpy, sloppy internet. Ah. Didn't think he was going to do that. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yep. <laughs> Come on, you son of a bitch. Him and Slorpy internet. Did I get that kick on him? Stupid thing. Just backstab fishing like a freaking asshole. Get him out of here. I just don't want to get backstabbed. <laughs> Come on. That didn't hit him, really. <laughs> Damn it, man. I can't get to him. Ah. I wanted that backstab. I couldn't get it. There it is. Ah. Oh. I want to do the spin to win. You 
lucky son of a bitch. <laughs> Come on! Oh, man. Whoa! Get him out of here! Spin the win! Spin the win! <laughs> oh, man. Wow. <laughs> he thought he could get the backstab with the perseverance. Oh, man. <laughs> Round something at 16 against Born to Souls. Well, I guess they didn't. They've never seen hyper armor before, so. I'll take it. I'll take it. Alright, here we go. Oh, here's another backstab, Fisher. Round 17 against Rich. I I don't know if I can win this match right here, actually. He backstab fishes. Like. No one else, really. Yeah, see, I was already rolling, and he already gets the backstab. And he gets the back swipe? Come on, that's so cheap. Yeah, he, he's from, like, Colombia, so he's able to get... That was weird. I definitely rolled. I don't, I don't know what the hell to do. I, I can't do anything. I have to, I literally have to wait for him. Lucky son of a bitch. I'm very pissed off about that backstab. Seriously. I'm so upset about that. Because you saw my body roll out of the way. I Because you got to understand. All right. I've played the game enough to know how the game works. And, on, and the connection doesn't even have to be great. It just has to be okay. You're able to do one R1 around anyone who rolls into you. And not get backstabbed if you roll out of the way immediately. It didn't happen there. I'm very upset about that. Alright, here we go. Round 17 against Cobra Dragon. Sharpening up his tools. This is actually a hard fight. Because of that hyper armor. Freaking full Havel Shrek. Damn, that full Havel is a nightmare. I don't know how to, because he's gonna keep using the hyper armor because it's it's mucho good. <laughs> Damn it, man! Damn. He's doing more damage. No, actually, well, I did hit him twice. He only hit me once. If he, if he does that freaking... What? Damn it. How was that even a possibility? I'm not stunning him at all. I don't know if that's because I'm just not hitting it or or what. Ah, I'm just afraid of the hyper armor. That's it. Just just throw out one out there. There it is. Damn it, man. Duh. There it is. That's what I wanted. Oh, this son of a bitch. He's looking to do massive damage. Alright, GG. I honestly I played like a bitch there. 
because that hyper armor is scary. I know the combos with that. I know the roll punishes. That's a freak. That's really. It's a tough matchup right there. Honestly, that's a really tough matchup. Um, it, it is. It's really tough. Uh, I think I'm gonna call it for this weapon. Um, I had some good matches. Really pissed off about my one loss though. I'll be honest. Really pissed off. I, I did pop the tears. At least there's that. So it would have been. It should have been anyway. A um. It definitely should have been a tie, but whatever. Tears is a thing in the game. Anyways, let's go through it. Let's go through the damage here. Uh, Heavy Wing Knight Halberd. 575 attack power. Here's the thing. The other Halberds have com... Well, a lot of the others have combos or other things that really make it more effective in some areas, some instances. Like, obviously, the Split Leaf has the crazy combo. The Black Glaive, or Black Knight Glaive has the combo. Grusifix is just damage and just range and all this, like, crazy stuff. And then you have, um, you have the, uh, Perseverance here. Charge on the regular Halberd, not tremendous, but there's a way to use it. And Champion Charge and other, the Spin Sweep, not the great, but you get what I mean. Like, some of the other ones' damages are possibly even left, uh, less. And you can even buff this if you make it heavy. So it, the damage can be much higher. So, But you just can't get the combos off, which is really where the damage goes. You just get two R1s. It still does a lot of damage. So 9.3 on this one. It's The damage is actually really good. And for the range, considering it, and you can still buff it, I think the damage is actually pretty good. As far as moveset. Now, I only use it two-handed. There are instances... Where one-handing it is okay. The R2 one-handing is actually really good against a lot of people. The panic roll and stuff like that. Um, the rolling, the rolling uh, R1 one-handed is uh, decent one-handed. It's not great two-handed, but it's okay. It's not like worthless. Um, then you have the weapon art, which is like. Yeah, it has hyper armor, but if you know this weapon, you should never, ever get caught or trapped in it. It's crazy. I did kill somebody with it who tried to backstab me while they had Perseverance. Hilarious. Get that victory on there. Classic. Anyways, the moveset, not tremendous, but because it does have the stun power and it does have the range, you can sort of keep people at bay a little bit. A little bit. There are some people who can basically just run at you and backstab you as soon as you press R1. I've seen that, but you just got to make sure you keep the spacing and the timing correctly. So the moveset is not great, but there is a way to use it. So I'm going to give it a 7.9. As far as the weapon art, weapon art's pretty bad. It is pretty bad. Maybe as a wake up, it's okay, but then why not just use the R2? Uh, yeah, so the weapon art just... Sure, it's awesome. It's cool. You just keep spinning till you have nothing left. You do have hyper armor when you do have FP. You, I think you only hit people two, t three times with it in a row or something if you get a hit. But that, it's just not enough to make it good. It's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. I'm going to actually give it a 6.0. It's really bad. Um, and as far as viability, is this viable? Versus other halberds, I do think it might have slight range on the other halberds. I'm very interested in that, actually. So if we just look at the range, <clears throat> it looks like it might have slight edge on the range on most halberds. Very slight. Except for maybe the Immolation Tinder. I don't think the Immolation tin Tinder and... Ugh. Crescent Axe is just... Ugh. Yeah, it might have the range slightly, very slightly. I don't, I don't know exactly where the hitbox is, but it might, it might have it. Um, but is it viable if somebody plays slow? If somebody has a shield, if somebody tries to backstab fish or basically do more than nothing, <clears throat> then you should not win against them. <laughs> so if somebody plays super slow, it's extremely difficult to win. That's the problem. It's just slow enough. However, you can pe keep people at bay. You do have the little stun. You do have the hyper armor. So there's a lot of goods, uh, positives, but there are some negatives. So it's not tremendous. I'm going to give it another 7.9. I don't think I can put it in the 8 category. Um, especially this one where it doesn't have enough um, combos to sort of outweigh the drawbacks i feel like unlike some of the other halberds that's why it's a little bit lower but i think you can utilize it i do think there is room 
for how gigantic this thing is. I mean, it looks menacing. There's no doubt about it. So I hope you enjoyed this live recording on twitch.tv forward slash Dante WTFUN. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you think, and I will be back.